The table shows the number of survey subjects who have received and not received a speeding ticket in the last year and the color of their car. Find the probability that a randomly chosen person, A, has a speeding ticket given they have a red car, and B, has a red car given they have a speeding ticket. Let's learn. For our first one here, A, has a speeding ticket given they have a red car. Our total here on the bottom is a total number of red cars that are there, which is 150. From that, the probability that they have a speeding ticket given they have a red car, we just look at that first row of red car and there are 15 people who have a speeding ticket because we were given they had a red car out of 150. Well, this just simplifies here to be 15 over 150 to be a one over 10. And that is a 0 0.1. And so the probability that they have a speeding ticket given they have a red car is 0 0.01. Now let's kind of reverse this with part B. Has a red car given they have a speeding ticket. The group of speeding tickets, the first column, has a total of 60. So our probability here, our total is 60. And the probability that they have a red card out of that 60 is going to be 15 now. So given they have a speeding ticket out of 16, a 60, there are 15 people who have a red car. We can simplify that to be 1 out of 4. And that comes out to be 0 0.25. So the probability that they have a red car given they have a speeding ticket is 0.25. I hope you learned something here on probability, and as always, thanks for watching.